Yes, we've got to... Is that actually working? Oh, it is now. We've got... I've, I've brought in a load of stuff that's... Um, kit that we've collected from Monk Makes. Um, so there's a Monk Makes starter kit, and I've got a few robot chassis, and some other bits of electronics, and various interface boards for the Raspberry Pi, and um, I didn't need any more. So that's um, a collection of some of my books that I just I wanted to give away, um, are going to be part of the raffle prize. But also CPC have very kindly produced um, a whole load of nice Lego style Raspberry Pi boxes. I don't know if you've seen them over there on the table in different colours. And um, what else have you brought? Other things? Uh, a code book experiment kit. A code book experiment kit. And a learn to solder kit. And a learn to solder kit by Brian Jepson, I believe, with a little book showing you how to do it and everything. Everything you need to learn to solder, basically. So we need a way of giving away these prizes. And um, being um, a Raspberry Pi event, we think that the way to do it is we'll actually end up going around giving everybody a number that you're then responsible for remembering. And then we're hoping somebody is going to write a little Python program or a little Scratch program that will generate a random number. Okay, we've got one more. Can I, I think we should... Can I do HTML? <laughs> no. Oh, I'll do it, yeah. <laughs> JavaScript, possibly. Yeah, that's good. Okay, okay. but it doesn't matter what language they use. It doesn't matter what language you use, but it'd be nice if a few people did it, and then I think maybe we could have a, a special prize for the best um, solution to giving away the raffle prizes as well, uh, to whoever does the best one. Okay, I'll pass back to Martin. Okay, thank you. That's all.